Kurt Charon Lee was the first Asian American officer in USMC history Navy Cross and Silver Star recipient in Korean War. Kurt Charon Lee served from 1944 through 1968. He served as the first Asian American Marine officer during the multi-year skirmish. He is known for saving over 8,000 men because he had the same blood as his enemy. His heroics have been recorded in books and documentary films. Born in San Francisco and raised in Sacramento, he enlisted in the U.S. Marine Corps towards the end of World War I, where he learned and taught Japanese. In 1946, he became a committed officer. In 1950, he was the first lieutenant in charge of a machine gun platoon. He is the only person of Asian ancestry, and many of his fallen Marines have never met any of his blood. He was often spoken about negatively behind his back, and many questioned his loyalty. Over time, he won the loyalty of his men when he consistently risked his life to protect his unit. One of his boldest acts was when he went to go solo to expose the location of the enemies and confuse them by using Mandarin. This heroic act awarded him the Navy Cross, the second highest honor a Marine can receive. His dauntless fighting spirit and resourcefulness served to inspire other members of his platoon. A final wound when he was saving his unit ended his combat duty in Korea. He was awarded the Silver Star. Major Lee retired from the Marine Corps in 1968 and later worked for New York Life and the National Rural Electric Cooperative Association. Kurt Charan Lee passed March 3, 2014 at the age of 88. His memory will go on through his bravery in saving the lives of so many.